The Powermaster 3302 is a revolutionary piece of field test equipment which utilities use to verify billing and metering accuracy on revenue metering sites. It easily detects revenue loss by ensuring the metering site is wired correctly and that the meter and instrument transformers are accurate under real-world conditions. The Powermaster 3302 is a handheld, lightweight device which features a true three-phase reference standard with 0.05% accuracy traceable to NIST, thus making it four times more accurate than most meters under test and six times more accurate than most CTs under test. Powermetrics is pleased to announce a new, lightweight, and economical accessory for the 3302 which allows utilities to perform phantom load ANSI meter tests on their transformer rated sites and perform burden added CT testing. This new accessory is offered in three different models. The model 335 offers a true three phase current source up to five amps per phase for ANSI meter testing and burden added up to two ohms and five steps for CT testing. The model 305 offers a true three phase current source up to five amps per phase for ANSI meter testing and the model 303 offers burden added up to two ohms in five steps for CT testing. All of these models fit neatly into the integrated carrying case of the 3302. They are also battery powered, so there is no need for an auxiliary power source, even when sourcing current. The current source is not limited to only a few amplitudes and power factors, but is totally configurable for any current and any power factor you wish to test. In addition to watt hour testing, the accessory also allows testing for VAR hour and VA hour. It also has the ability to perform meter testing under forward or reverse energy flow and can test individual elements of the meter as well. The current source can also generate harmonic conditions in addition to purely sinusoidal waveforms. At Powermetrics, we take the safety of your metering personnel very seriously. That is why we designed the three series and associated load box and burden accessory with CAT4 600 volt safety compliance. It is the only product in its class manufactured in the United States to offer you this extra level of protection. For today's demonstration, we will be performing a true three phase ANSI meter test on a form 9S meter under the test points of full load, power factor, and light load with the 3302 and 335 accessory. You can perform this test directly at the meter test switch in the field, eliminating the need to pull the meter and test it with an expensive meter test board, thus increasing efficiency and lowering costs. The 3 Series measures the exact same voltages as the meter by hooking directly to the test switch. The Model 335 accessory sources three completely independent phases of current at the test switch with the included duckbill current probes. You will simply need to shunt the secondary of the CTs at the test switch and then install three jumpers to create the path for each phase of the current to the meter. Remember, this is a true three-phase ANSI meter test, not simply a series single-phase test like many other phantom load tests performed in the field with older test equipment. The Powermaster must also count the meter revolutions or watt-hour pulses the meter outputs. For this test, we will be using our magnetic IR pulse detector. Now let's start the test. With the 3302 and 335 accessory, you can use the integrated site testing menu to perform a complete site analysis of the metering site, which would include a wiring verification of the site, CT, PT, and meter tests under real-world customer load conditions, and then finally the ANSI meter test. For this demonstration, we will simply be performing the ANSI meter test by itself. We simply scroll to meter testing and press enter. We then scroll to phantom load and press enter. We then choose the desired test we wish to perform. For this test, we will be performing the ANSI 2.5 amp full load power factor light load test, which will run the full load test at 2.5 amps at unity power factor then the power factor test at 2.5 amps at 0.5 power factor, and lastly, the light load test at 0.25 amps at unity power factor. The user can create their own test points and pulses per test to match their own utility standard. We then simply press F6 to continue. The three series prompts the user to connect the jumpers at the test switch 
to create the current path so we can source current to the meter. If this is not done correctly, the 3 series will not allow the test to continue. We hit F6 to continue. The 3 series will perform a quick diagnostic analysis and then begin sourcing current to the meter. The 3 series then waits until a meter pulse is detected. At that point, we simply press F6 to start the test. The 3 series will then begin the actual test of the meter. For each test point, the 3 series displays the voltage, the current, the power factor, the time that has elapsed during the test, the number of test pulses, and finally the percent registration of the meter under those test points. You can see that for this test, the meter was well within its accuracy specification on full load, power factor, and light load test points, so we can simply hit F6 to stop the test. The test data has now been saved in the database and can be easily shared throughout the utility. In just a few minutes, you have completed the true three-phase ANSI meter test. If you have any questions about this demonstration, please let us know. Thank you for your time, and as always, be safe out there when you're testing.